Hey YouTube, this is a Crypto Life Sister update and I just wanted to let you know, especially if you haven't joined the fan page, that we do have, a, there is a January challenge going on. This year I wanted to do something different. I wanted to have like monthly challenges that we can do each month. And if you didn't know already, we're doing a swap challenge. Now you can still catch up and do it, but it started yesterday and um, you probably already saw the chart before this and I have if you go to the fifth plus sister fan page which the link will be in the description box so just click on show more and then you know click on the link you'll it'll get you over there to the Facebook page now I will also have a link to the challenge now I have on there the benefits first I have how to do a squat properly now as you can see on the picture of the challenge there are a variety of ways that you can do a squat. You can do a regular squat, you can use weights to do a squat, you can, I mean, you can lift one leg and do a squat. I'm saying there's different ways. So that's why I have different pictures of different people, the way they're doing the squats, that you can try it however you want to, you know, try it. So I also have the benefits of doing the squats. Now I do have a disclaimer down at the end that if you do, if you have knee problems, if you experience pain doing this, to stop doing it. You know, also you know your body. If you can't go as many as we have set for the day, then just do as much as you can. We're not gonna boot anyone out. This is, if you can only do 10, then that is fine, just do 10. At least you can do some squats every day. But um, this is a challenge we're gonna do now you still do your regular workouts throughout the week it's just this is just a challenge that we're going to do above and beyond our normal workouts so i just wanted to come on here and let you know that also i i spend a lot of my time on the fit flex sister fan page so the um, fitflexsister.com site i went ahead and canceled that and i opened up a free site since I'm hardly on there, I'm just, just go ahead and open the Weebly site. And then I'm going to still have all the information on that site. So it's going to be fifthlifesisters.net. I'll have on there, um, we'll have the monthly challenges on there. So that'll be a way that everything I post on Facebook page will be on the site. And I will also try to feature weight loss um, um, success stories and things so to help keep you encouraged. So I have a thing where it's just going to be filled with, you know, with all the um, feature fit flexors that we had last year, I'll place it on under the success stories. And if you have a success story, you lost some weight, you're getting in shape, then you can share that on the fan page. I'll make sure not only to post it on the fan page, but also so, on the site um, the as well. The fit sister family is growing. We have over 4,400 fans i have no idea where all the fans are coming from i really don't i like to always know because i like to thank you know people for sending people over to the fan page but i do know that um we have 4476 what 4476 fit for life sister fans as of right now and we keep getting you know new fans so welcome to all the new fans and it's hard for me to thank everyone by name of course but i do like to from time to time thank a few people by name and to just welcome them to the fan page and a lot of you guys have joined in you guys this fit for life sister squat challenge has spread so fast i didn't know that i would get this kind of response from this challenge there was a squatathon challenge the month before i heard about it so i just went off of what they did each day how many squats and just come to put together the fit for life sister squat challenge so um i think next month is going to be i'm going to do a is it the jumping jack challenge i might do three different types of exercise moves throughout the whole month that we'll do maybe a combination of jumping jacks jump rope and something else we'll see whatever i come up with <laughs> but it's going to be a good challenge that we can do so to keep us encouraged and sometimes if someone doesn't have anything to do you can do this at work the squat challenge you can do this at work you can get up from your desk do your squats and then get back to doing what you're doing so I just want to come on here to tell you guys about the challenge and also the fifth plus sister t-shirts are on sale the 25% off and just like I posted last night that I finally went through my fifth plus sister t-shirt boxes and actually found some more mediums because I thought I was almost out of stock in the mediums but I have eight I believe I have eight mediums in stock. We, I still have a lot of large, some extra large, and I'm almost out of stock with the 2XL. 
so I but those are the sizes medium large extra large and 2xl those are the different sizes uh, once these all sell out I do want I will carry small medium because I know there are people that wanted to get a small size but I didn't get that starting off but um, we will get that also I'm planning to get Thrift Plus Sisters wristbands I had talked about that some last year but that will be coming so just check it out I also have on when you go on the thriftflysister.net site I do have stores so it'll take you directly to the, the Zipporah Beauty website so you can purchase your shirt there so that's it I just wanted to come on here give you a quick few updates and um, yes and thank you to all of you that have commented on my the what was it my my last check-in my last Thrift Plus Sister check-in for 2012 thank you to everyone that commented on that video and there have been people that have asked questions have you did you get a tummy tuck now you guys know this if you've been following me since so the start you of guys my journey, know when I started this takes some hard work you guys just my motto that I say a lot now is exercise plus eating right plus consistency equals results I'm telling you guys that's that's the key there is no secret it took some hard work yeah it took some hard work sometimes when I wanted to cry it hurt um, when I didn't feel like working out and I did and push myself I mean to where you start pushing yourself where you know your body's not used to this you start jogging when you want to give up you want to just sit down and not really do anything you have to push past it so it it does take some hard work and you just keep at it and keep at it and keep at it and I'll put a picture up so you can see what I'm talking about You can tell by my midsection that for me, I know I needed to change. I knew I needed to change because of the, the health risks associated with belly fat. So I'm, I'm telling you this to encourage you that you can do it. If you stick with it, even if you tried before, because you guys, I have tried this before. I have been that before size for a few years. I've tried stuck with something probably for three weeks and then I'd stop and just go back to just doing what I was doing. So it just, it all, it came back to the point when I'm saying, you know what, this is for life. This isn't just for some, a short period of time and I can just go back to my old ways. No, this is stay active for life. Fitness, not just for a season, but for life. That's what Fit Flex is just about. So also, um, you know, when you wear your Fit Flex t-shirt, that's spreading the message to people, not just to get in shape, but to stay in shape. So go check out the fan page, join in the squat challenge. I hope you join us. If you want to do videos, share videos on the fan page and things like that. Cause I want to start a note on YouTube channels so people can share their YouTube channel, especially if you're, you know, documenting your weight loss journey or something like that. So. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, you have a blessed day. And remember to love the hair and body God gave you. Bye.